Right, so today's job, we're going to give this a little whirl and we're going to make some stickers for van. We're going to stick it up, some vinyl on it. I don't know how to use this. So this is going to be a learning curve as well. Let's, let's have a look. Three, two, one, action. Yeah. Oops. Oh, it's getting some right fingerprints on it already. Do we cut that off there? No, a bit further up. There? Yeah. Yeah, not even turned on. You ain't even doing your design. Is that 600 that? That's as big as you want it to be. Well, this is the biggest way it can go because this machine only does this size. It's just started, what I call it. We've just had to. It's just puckered up. So now we're having to try and level it back out again because it's vinyl's crap. Stuff out. Let's see what, what do you press? You need to press that flashing arrow on crack up machine. That one? Yep. That's so you should start flashing. Because this isn't quite big. Oh, what do you press now then? The see on machine that's flashing. these cards are not big enough and this machine don't cut big enough we've got to do it in three bits like that this is for that to uh, now it's going Let it do its thing. Now you've got to take this off here. Oh, huh? Tent, um. Tent got it right. Can I pass my own scissors? Turn to start the top. <laughs> yeah, it's only tap water. Oh, I've been all on my feet. That's not right, is it? Oh. Which scissors? Right, I left Iveco sign under there because, and you can see it, I was unsure whether I like that or not because I bought the bottom and, and the top and but the top one covers, um, there's a sensor there 
the, I don't know if camera's picking up, but there's a sensor in the middle of the screen that does lane assist. And uh, I don't like that. Well, I didn't know if I liked it or not, just leaving it bottoming on. Does anybody know how to get this off? I'm going to order some tar and glue remover off of Amazon. I'm going to need a fair bit like, I don't know how to get it off. I want to brighten it up a bit. What chance of them dots staying on? Oh, I've lost one. Shit. Tip tool. Hmm. That's why you're supposed to apply heat. I ain't got heat. Ah! Oh, I thought it was done then.
Right, nothing much has changed since last update apart from I've taken this back off here because uh, I needed to get to exhaust and I've piped it so it goes down and out so that's all I've done since last, last video got some lagging in it I need to make a guard mark for you just so that people don't touch that but uh, that's, that's the only thing that we've done since last video but today we've got inside, outside, underside of that um, them fuel bits inside like back doors uh, just, just going to brighten that off there's, there's back doors in there and then we've, it goes on top of this and we've got this to do it's quite a big job but I should get it done today bit of luck We just were ripping all the paint and rust off it and then it's going to the body shop and it's going to get painted we're just going to save them a lot of time by doing blasting i don't know how i'm going to get inside of that light but we'll figure that out when we come to it wheels bugs yeah you get a picture
That's that one. Inside and out, doors, them things. Just gonna key this up for paint. He's gonna flip it over and also we do it on the side. Yeah, let's crack on.
covered in dust, but that's it done. Yeah, fuck new people, and I'm gonna say it again, but this stuff, it's mill scale. I just wanted it key enough, if you can see it key. Just wanted a profile so I can paint to it. Don't need to break through that mill scale. As long as it's got its key. It's better than scotching it off anyway. Yeah, that looks like it, but it's not. It's just mill scale. It comes off in different places. Loads of dust on it, but yeah, you get a picture. Hey, right, catch you on next one.